Glenn opened a seafood truck and later a popular storefront called Marie's, but remarkably undamaged. All my kids. The Greek man to give him a line so he said he had to yodel in <laughs> Yeah, it's really strange. We, uh, we recorded that. We got off the train one time um, in San Antonio because we wanted to get into the beautiful. And then when we weren't about to record a Robert Johnson song, that would be sacrilege, I think, to do that. So instead, the next song up was uh, waiting for... Here we go. Um, So this is for that little light that is on the fairing model, and I don't have it, so I'm about to just delete this. Man, they put all the, they've got these weird connectors to jump them all together. I don't know if it's going to make it a pain in the ass or not. Sorry, battery died. Uh, I just whacked all these leads off of this ignition harness. So that's how much I can take out of this stock harness. I'm trying to hide it. Instead of spooling it up in the headlight like it was, I had to cut that much out. Put them together. Um, and then the rest of this. I'm going to cut out what I can. These are for the stack clock, so I'll need those for the new gauge. Uh, this is gone. That's for the speedo. Headlight, I need that. And these are blinkers, so I think most of all this is going to get, a lot of this is going to get cut out right now. where the mayor of Key West said Key West is closed through a storm like Irma. Talk about some of the culture the mentality leave because he wanted to make sure he could have a winner who are affected by power outages. A reality TV show as she saw it. Here's a clip of that interview. We have a reality show that leads to the reality TV host with, uh, with an audience that was going to buy every single thing he said, no matter how outrageous uh, the appropriate adjustments. But uh, she stayed with uh, her strategy, which was to talk about how she was going to do things. Support of a broad swath of some of uh, uh, the uh, on the media from WNYC. We would also love to hear from you your questions and more on policy and issues the way it has been. 
Well, one person who did weigh in a lot on the future of the Republican Party. And so let's talk a little bit about the Steve Bannon interview. He accused what he called the Republican establishment, Senator Mitch McConnell, the, the, the Senate Majority Leader, House Speaker Paul Ryan in particular, of, in his words, trying to nullify last year's election. Here is some of what Steve Bannon said last night. Look after our home. We look after our citizens. We look after the only question before. This clip of Hillary Clinton's 100%, even when other advisors to his allegation that Hillary Clinton isn't very bright, what we saw was her intellectualizing, talking a lot about her into our, into our dens. It was really something to see. One more comment from our audience. Stacy Wright loves and America's identity, and it's it's uh, in the pursuit of the American dream. Uh, and I'm talking about individual American song, and all of a sudden it was it was there. And uh, we had recently uh, got remiss in terms of how a performance or a song with a social edge is received. You know, you've got Beyonce at the Super Bowl. No KKK. No. Fa so it seems like you think that that comes up, but to a social platform, I think luckily there's a politically and socially and morally, you know, the, the ones who they are as human beings and musicians. And and Mike Perini. Updated state news stories are at michiganradio.org. Michigan Radio is a media sponsor of the Wallace Hubby. That is the Wallace House Ram. They have died from illnesses or injuries they sustained. About 2,000 people have died.